I'm Bryn Brown, president and co-founder of Frontier Justice, and today we're going to be talking about gun safety. Gun safety is paramount at Frontier Justice. It means everything to us. Obviously, we sell a tool, the firearm, that can be misused or there can be accidents. We want to minimize all the risk by following basic safety rules always. The four firearm safety rules we cover all the time at Frontier Justice. In fact, our staff cover it every single day in huddle. So the first firearm safety rule is always keep your finger off the trigger until you're ready to shoot. Always make sure the muzzle is pointed in a safe direction. Always, always assume a firearm is loaded. No matter when or how you come into contact with it, assume it's loaded. And always know your target and what is beyond your target. This is really important for self-defense situations in particular. People think, well, I'll just pull my firearm and defend myself. But what they always need to be thinking of is not only what they intend to shoot a threat, but what might be beyond that threat. We do have a strict dress code at Frontier Justice on the range, and we have it for very important reasons. We don't want people to wear things that um, bunch around their neck or would catch brass when they're shooting. That means when you shoot, a brass casing comes out of your firearm, and those can go different directions. If it gets caught in your shirt, goes down your shirt, those sort of things, it can get against your skin, and it's very hot. It's called the hot brass dance, and people start to move around because it just takes them off guard. When that happens, they don't always have the wherewithal to think to have their firearm pointed in a safe direction, downrange, or lay the firearm down before they start that movement because it's so uncomfortable. So this is part of the reason dress code is so important to us. We also have lead considerations. When you're on a range and you're shooting firearms, lead is a contaminant. It's not safe for human beings, so we have the best air recirculation system in the world on our range. So every 90 seconds, air is pushed away from your face. So no lead gets in your blood or your lungs. And so a lot of people don't know this about ranges. It can be very unsafe if the filters aren't changed correctly and that sort of thing. But it also comes down to clothing. You don't want long robes or coats or dresses dragging the ground because potentially it's picking up lead dust off the floor. And when that happens, you take that with you. You take it home, you take it through our store and those sort of things. So we do, we have blue sticky mats just outside the range to catch any of those particles off the bottoms of your shoes. We also don't want your toes to be exposed for the same reasons. We don't want hot brass to hit your feet. We don't want anybody to step on your foot. We don't want anything to create unsafe reactions on the range when handling firearms. Really important at Frontier Justice that when people bring in a firearm to shoot on the range, they're bringing firearms from home, that they have those holstered or cased walking through the store. We can't always be sure that people have unloaded their firearms and they're carrying um, a firearm that wouldn't potentially go off. So we want to make sure they're holstered and cased for that reason so that no, nothing hits the trigger in case inadvertently there could be ammunition loaded into that firearm. We have a full-time staff of range safety officers. So when you go out onto the range, you can be assured that there's a person that is there monitoring everything that happens and making sure everyone around you is as safe as you are being on the range. Those range safety officers are there to help you with questions, but they're also there to make sure that people are fo following the four firearm safety rules, that they're not taking unsafe actions. We have a real responsibility to keep everyone that comes within our stores and our ranges safe. If you have any other questions about gun safety, please visit our website, frontier-justice.com.